So the first thing we are going to do is obviously download the WinRAR file you see here. This here, change your pack.rar. And in this pack, you will find the other search engine. If you open this one, you will find two injectors. It doesn't matter which one you use, just like one. And you will also find a DOL. Now we are going to use the DOL to inject into CSGO. So what you do, you just simply run CSGO. Now just simply open up the injector you want to use. Um, you can see that there is only one injector on my screen because this folder is an old folder I use for this video. Now just simply click on uh, this button and select the DLL you want to use. That's the here change the DLL. Just open it up. Uh, you will hear a beep once it's injected. You'll see inject it successfully just close this or click continue and close it make sure you close it now in game you just click insert on your keyboard and it's gonna open up the menu First first. At skins, you can go to the name, and there you will be able to find all the weapons where you can change the skins from. For the purpose of this video, I will use the op. Here at skins, you can select a skin you would like to use. I think I'm going for the red line on the op. And obviously, you can apply stickers. If you scroll down, you will find more stickers. And I'm gonna use this one. You can also change the skin pattern. You can also select the rear. The higher the value is, the better the skin will be. Um, I'll leave it on zero to keep it on factory new. You can also give it a name tag. And obviously, you can also turn on stat track on this one with the kills you want. Now, if we click add, we will get the weapon in our inventory. If we click insert again, we can go to our inventory and find that the op is here in the inventory. Click continue, and now you can easily select the weapon for both CT and C. The fun thing of this game changer is we can also select containers. I'm gonna go for the CSGO weapon case. We click add, and as you can see, we now have the case. And we can also get ourselves some free keys. Make sure you use the same key as the same crate. And now you can open up the container by clicking unlock container. And I'm from the Netherlands, so I cannot open up this case. Be right back.
forgiveness, pray to God I see tomorrow. I don't wanna die young, but if I do, then I'll be ready when that time come to him, slime me like a sun. I'm not trying to make a man, trying to make a couple million. I don't wanna be the boss, I'm trying to own the building. I don't care what I've got on, I'll touch records and the guilty. Hope they miss me when I'm gone, but if they don't, no What we can also do is change our profile. So if we want to be global elite, we just select global elite here at competitive. And we can do the same for both Wigman and Danger Zone. We can also change our XP and level of the account. And obviously you can change your wins too. You can get yourself leader comments, friendly comments, teacher comments. And you can even fake bans. By clicking apply, you will make changes to your account. But be sure the screen changer is client side only. So other people will not be able to see your account. Here at the miscellaneous tab, you can change the aspect ratio, the unlock inventory access, the auto accept. Aspect ratio will basically change your resolution and basically stretch it. The unlock inventory means that while you are in game, you are able to change your weapons. Make sure this one is on because in game it's really useful. And the auto acceptor will automatically accept once the round is starting. And last thing, you can also add convicts. Um, by clicking add convict, you can name your convict and create it. And now if you make a list of skins, you can save that convict. So next time when you are starting up CSGO, you can load the convict again and still have the same skins. Now you will see some gameplay of me using this cane changer. I will not add any commentary to it, just enjoy it.